Introduction Compaction test provides a value of compacted density at the optimum moisture content, which can be used for field work. When the maximum dry density and the optimum moisture content of the soil are obtained from the test, this will provide the best water content for achieving high dry density. Our objective in this experiment is First, to determine the optimum moisture content of a disturbed soil sample. To establish a moisture density relationship of the soil, the apparatus needed in this test are the following. Vernier caliper Graduated cylinder Straight edge Mixing tray Rubber mallet Moisture cans Sieve number 4 Rammer and mold Extruder Oven Balance Using vernier caliper, MESURE the diameter of the mold 6 times at the top and 6 times at the bottom. Measure also the interior height 3 times at equal spacing around the circumference. Use this formula in solving the average top, bottom and height of the molds. First step in calibration test. Use this table in deciding which test method to use. In this test, we chose method A. Second step, weight the compaction mold with its base. Then weight the empty moisture cans and record measurements. Fourth, use the graduated cylinder to measure out the water to be added. Take note, to determine the amount of water to be added for the first test, assume water content to be 8% of the soil weight. Water to add in milliliter equals soil mass in grams times 8% over 100. Add water to the soil in the tray and mix IT thoroughly by hand until the moisture is uniformly distributed. Fifth, in the mold spread soil into a layer uniformly thickness and compact the soil according to the number of layers specified by the type of compaction method used in the table shown. Make sure the mold is completely filled with soil. Then blow eat again with the rammer. Carefully remove the collar. Then trim and level off excess compacted soil beyond the rim of the mold. Weigh the compacted soil with the mold and its base. Then record its mass. 
After that extrude the soil. Split the soil sample with your knife and take samples from the top and the bottom. Then weight the moisture can with soil sample. Then oven dry sample. Transfer the extruded soil specimen from the mold into the mixing tray and break up the soil mass until IT looks similar to its original condition. Here are the data gathered. To get the value of the optimum moisture content, graph the dry density versus the moisture content.